Welcome to Greenland Gamers, this is Jekka I've got another Throwback Thursday for you today. We've got a new one in the uh, Nintendo Classic Library, Fire and Ice. Never heard of it, don't know what it is, I have no clue how to play this thing. Let's play it together. Tecmo. I don't get the rabbit for Tecmo because I've always thought of Tecmo as Tecmo Bowl, the football game, but oh well. Anyways, a long time ago there was an ice island far to the north. It was called Cool Mint Island. Cool. <laughs> a peaceful island inhabited by the winter fairies. Okay. But one day... An evil wizard named Drudel sent flame monsters to the island. Oh, great. If something isn't done, Coolmind Island will melt away. In response to this crisis, Queen of the Winter Fairies called upon a wizard. She chose a novice wizard named Dana. <laughs> Great. A novice. Why didn't you get an expert or something? Dana, I'll give you ice magic to extinguish the evil flames. You have been chosen for your wisdom and courage. We trust you, Dana. Okay, start. Grandma, can you tell me a story? Okay, would you like to hear the story about Dana? Yes. <laughs> uh, oh, okay. Beginning, continue, and edit mode. I assume this is, you know, you continue, you have either save game or a password or something, edit mode, I'm not sure what that is. I'm gonna go ahead and just do beginning. Interesting. Oh. Okay. B does something. A does something. Up doesn't seem to do anything. Down doesn't seem to do anything. Start. Just kind of goes to a screen. Select doesn't seem to do anything. Oh. Okay. Oh, wait. Okay. A and B seem to do the same thing. Okay, good, they fall. I was wondering how I was going to get that. Yay, we beat the stage. Okay, so it's a little puzzle game. Okay, you go to the same ones again. Oh, he automatically jumps. I was wondering about that. Is that going to crush me? Okay. <laughs> so I can't get crushed by ice, but I can let it fall on stuff. So far, so good. Don't use this as a step. Okay. Okay, that, that seems easy. I wonder when it'll start getting harder. This is a weird map, because I would think that you would just go to the next worlds and stuff. Oh wait, I can move on there. Interesting. But, uh... I wonder if you can just do these out of order. I don't know, I don't care. I'm just gonna go in order. Normally up at the top you'd have a bunch of stuff. Ooh, what's this? Okay. I'm holding up the ice, but as soon as I step out it should crush everything, right? Yeah! And how am I jumping with my head through the ice? <laughs> All right. If I hit B, it lets me go back out here. Interesting, I can go to different worlds and start on those worlds. I'm betting the difficulty level goes up quite a bit. If I hit A, I go into the world, and then I go down again, so, okay. Um. Oh. Huh. 
how? Aha. Okay. So I can only make things go down. There, okay. That was an interesting twist on it. So far this seems like a really simple game, but fun nonetheless. You know, as far as it goes. Okay. <laughs> now he's jumping on the air. He has a fairy, I guess, or a wizard or something. Interesting. Let's see. This one I can... Do that and then just put something on top of it? No. Oops. No. There. Okay. Now... How do I do this? Oh, okay. Should... Well... Okay, so this doesn't do anything. What? I can't make anything go up. sensitive to there okay this is gonna take a while and I'm not even sure if I can do all of it oh, oh, come on way too sensitive on the controls um How do I get one to fall? Can't just push down, can I? Uh, hmm. So I've got the two blocks there, but I just need to get rid of this last one here. at all. Yeah, select doesn't do anything. See, and that one doesn't fall. If I could get that one to fall, but it sticks to the side. Is there any way to get it to not stick? I can't think of any way to do that. Let's try again.
goes all the way there. Here we go, maybe I can do this. Now if I do that, will that be enough? Because I just needed the one, right? Yeah, okay, now I should be able to do this, okay. Whew. <laughs> Track of these. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait, no. oh, come on. Okay. There we go. Okay. Just had to remember to grab the stuff from the top. Interesting. Okay, what do we got here? Um. If I go this way, it's gonna maybe push it. Just need to make sure that I have an extra bit. I should be able to do that, I think. Just to be sure, though, I'll take an extra block with me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh no, I'm stuck. Never mind. I can't take an extra block with me. I get stuck. Okay. So forget that. Um, <laughs> okay. Boom. Now, if I come here... That's easy. Okay. Yeah, a few little missteps here and there, but I like that you can retry the stage easily without completely dying. It's like a, it's not really a, a game where you're up against a clock, kind of like Solomon's Key was, because this reminds me of Solomon's Key, kind of, except it's a lot more laid back. Still a puzzle and still, still, you know, fun, but it's a lot more laid back. Um, ooh. Well, there's only one way to go. Push it that way and then scoot over to it. Wait a minute. Get that one over there to get an extra thing on it. Okay. Huh. I should have. I think I should have made an extra one here too. Let's try that again. Got that. Oops. Um, so I'm not exactly sure on this one. So I've got to get this one to go away. As long as I have that block there, I can make new ones. There. Okay. Okay. 
So not tough. A little confusing, but not tough. Ooh, there's a castle, like Mario. I'm not controlling this, by the way. I'm just going. Ha ha ha. Can you get out of my labyrinth? Probably it's, you know, World 1. <laughs> sure hope I can anyways. Oh. What? No, 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 no. <laughs> okay. This is moving faster than I thought it would. Oops. How is this? Oh. Okay, so this is no longer super fun. I mean, you know, like, no no pressure whatsoever type of thing. This is... This is pressure. Okay, so that was actually easy. Grr. Don't dare to think you have beaten me. <laughs> what was that guy's name again? Dru Druid? Druidy? Druidal? Droodle? Droodle. Ice Rock Island clear! Yay! Continue story, sure. Now in World 2. Alright, let's see what we got here. 2 1. Oh, what's this? Well, not much I can do with this. I gotta go that way. No, no, no! Went too far. First, I think. Since there's no way to get back up. Oh, come on. Oh. Still able to do it, just a little bit more. I didn't even have to do that. A little bit more work than before. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I'll just take this anchor off, and boom! <laughs> I was just about going to go try and do multiples on that, uh, like, you know, create one, drop it, create another one, drop it, push it, and yeah, stuff like that, but no, uh, uh, that would have been stupid. Okay. <laughs> okay. Here is to not 
remove too many ice things, because if you remove too many, you don't have any platforms, because you can't make any straight ahead of you. You can only make them... Um, wait, is that... Yeah, it should be fine. You can only make them below you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, how do I do this? Oh wait, I can just push that. Okay. <laughs> uh, just what made it harder than it needed to be. What the... I'm glad that doesn't crush me, because that would be bad. Okay, 2-5. What is this? Okay. If I take that out, then I fall in the flame. If I take the other one on the other side out... So I have to take that out, but then I go around and drop that on him. Okay, these are all doable because they're just one step. Okay. Whoa. Uh. Wait. That is one thing, it's just a little too sensitive for these things. Now, oops. Now this should work. Yeah. Just gotta make sure if you create it, it if you create it in that one place next to a wall, it'll latch onto that wall. But if you create it somewhere else, you know, disconnect it from the wall and then push it, it won't latch on when you push it into the wall. Okay. Two six. What the Well, let's push that that way. Repetitive in the way that you actually take care of things. Um, the way it's uh, it's put together is different, though. Some of these are easier to figure out than others, just because you use the same kind of moves. Um, other ones, just you know, the way they're laid out is just different, and so it's more difficult. Okay, let's do this first. I was sure it was going to kill the flame once the ice dropped. Okay. So how do I get that thing to die? Wait. Get rid of that. Uh, that doesn't work. Wait. Okay, so push that out of the way. 
rid of that. too tempting to just throw the, the ice block on that thing, so I knew there had to be something else. Oh, fun. Um, I mean, it's easy enough to get that guy on the left, but then how do I get out? That's the thing. So I'm thinking that's the end. So, boom. Okay. This is this is a rather enjoyable game. Um, it's right now it's pretty easy. I mean, I've still had to reset my stage a couple times or a few times. Um, but I like that it's a casual type of game um, that I don't really have to worry about the timer or anything. Well, except for the the castle stage at the end. That that's kind of annoying. <laughs> stuff here. Oh. Did I just... I think I just killed myself. <laughs> yeah, I needed to get another block, go or another ice block going. Okay. Forgot about it being stuck. There. Now, what do I do with this one? Should be able to do it fine. This guy's just simply pushing the block into him. There we go. That was a little challenging there. Alright, drawbridge came down. Let's go in. <laughs> we'll see how I do on this. A lizard? Well, what is that? Try out my maze. <laughs> is that a flame chameleon or something? A fire salamander? 
Uh... No, 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 no. <laughs> this is timed. It doesn't seem to be timed. Whoa. I don't know if I got enough stuff going here to... <laughs> At least I duck below these things, but... Yeah, I don't have any... I gotta try again. don't have anything to do it with. Um... Now... I hate how sensitive that is where you just fall off right away. Swoop. Give myself an extra few blocks just to be sure. Yeah, I don't know if I can do this. Um, I'll have to think about this for a while, but we've already been playing this game for a while, so I'm going to call it good for now. I might have to figure this one out some other time. But the game's fun. Um, for a casual type of thing, um, where you don't want any pressure or anything really, you just want to kind of puzzle things out in your mind, definitely a fun game. Um, I was really surprised, actually, when I first got into the game and saw what it was. I was like, there's no way this is going to be fun. I had nightmares back from Solomon's Key. Um, so yeah, it, it turned out actually really nicely. I actually enjoyed this game. Um, like I said, it's got to be for you know when when you're not looking to have like, tons of action or anything. You just want something to challenge your brain, not necessarily your uh, you know your hand-eye coordination or something like that. But if that's the game you're looking for, it's a really quite a fun game actually. And, and the difficulty level is starting to ramp up a little bit. Um, so, anyways, let me know what you thought of this game. Um, you know, go ahead and leave comments below, and if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, tell your friends and family, and I'll see you again uh, on Greenland Gamers. See ya.